Hi, I'm Nico. I'm a freshman here at USC. I'm majoring in philosophy, politics, and law. And some of my favorite stuff to do outside of classes is to go take the metro down to LA or Santa Monica and just like see the sights and eat some food, you know? <laughs> So a typical day in the life for me is like waking up at like around 9.50, 10 a.m. ish, getting some breakfast in at EVK, which is one of like, I would say like the lowest ranked dining halls, but you know, it's still food. And then after that, I go to class at 11 a.m., which is my geology class. And then after 3.30, I'm pretty much done with classes. And then I'll usually go back to my dorm and like get some food with some friends and hang out for a while and then chill and then usually at night like around six or seven I'll have some club activities and then um, I'll usually just come back to my room at like nine or ten and then I'll just work at Levy Library until like 1 a.m. 2 a.m. just getting all my work done so pretty much a typical day for me so this isn't normally like a normal day here at USC but today we're having like a career involvement fair where like a ton of businesses and stuff will come out here set up a booth and then allow students to pretty much come up to them like show them their resumes and like have a little bit of conversation with them get to know them maybe network and find like opportunities to work with them. So that's pretty cool. All right, so right here where we are, we are at the Von Kleinsmid, like school kind of, it's where a ton of classes are. Funny thing, I'm pretty sure, I could be wrong, Von Kleinsmid was a eugenist, so kind of some shady stuff here with USC, but yeah. Um, down that hall over there is where I have my international relations class and it's for my major, which is, you know, philosophy, politics, and law, which I think is a really cool major because you kind of like get like all these different aspects of like philosophy, politics, and law, and so it just like combines them all in this very like, it's like a very like interdisciplinary major that just like allows you to like see like society and like how things are in like a different way that is like the perspective of these three kind of topics. So what's different with philosophy, politics, and law is that like, you get like all these different fields in like if you're not simply focusing in like political science or like mainly just history like you see like the philosophy aspects and like policies and law and so it's like how all those three things kind of like connect in like this big broader like image of like society working and in our government and like how they all play off one another and how they all contribute and you can sort of make all these like connections with one another to help you understand things because I wasn't sure what major I wanted to take when I was applying but I think PPL just sort of gave me like the freedom to like take classes in all these different fields that I really enjoyed. It's an honestly like it's surprisingly like a really easy major like only 36 units for the degree so nine classes over four years like it's definitely like, a lot of flexibility to explore other places as well which I think is really cool. The, my favorite class that I've taken so far has been my seminar class in climate change. Completely recommend it. Shout out to those teachers. I forgot their names right now, so I'm sorry about that. But GSEM 130, climate change, the science, history, and future of it. Very important class because I feel like climate change is a very important issue that I care about a lot. So yeah. Right, right over here we have Doheny Library, which is one of the best libraries on campus, mostly because it just has a lot more architectural stuff, like a lot nicer, kind of it, but always nicer to be working somewhere aesthetic. So um, when thinking about like general education requirements here at USC, it's pretty cool. We have, um, for my school in Dorn Scythe, we have um, language requirements, which requires us to take at least three semesters of a language. There's stuff like math, which is pretty, standard English writing 150 and an upper division writing class is also required along with like some science stuff as well like a physical science and a life science class with labs and another cool thing an arts class which for me at least my arts class has been my favorite class or one of my favorite classes that I've taken here I've only taken eight so far so not much to really reference off but I really like that about USC encouraging people to take like classes in like arts as well and other stuff that doesn't really connect to our major. So right here where I am, we're by the reflecting pool, which is pretty much just like a regular fountain. It looks really nice and people like come out here and study and work a lot. And then right behind that, we have my dorm, which is Burn Krant, seven floors of open doors, it's been called. It's a really social dorm, pretty much like it's a really nice community of people who are like very nice and you can pretty much find anyone like similar interest as you there. So at USC, like social life is pretty much like, there's a very much a culture of going out, I would say, because we're right in the middle of like Los Angeles and the metro is like literally like 
five minutes off campus walking. So you can go like pretty much anywhere. You can go down to LA, go to some nightclubs and all that, eat some food, see some museums, go down to Santa Monica, see the beach, hang out, eat food and all that. And there's like a lot of parties kind of in the area too. Usually have like fraternities and like some clubs have parties. And there's a lot of venues that it can be rented out to be used for any like social events and all that. Well, I think the most like surprising thing about like coming here to USC for my first year was like how easy it was to kind of like find friends around here. Like you don't really expect it. Like USC is kind of like a big campus in a big city, but I think here like you can really find like so many opportunities to really find like your group of people or like people that you really enjoy. Like let that be like through clubs, the people in your dorm, like everything here is just like really social and it's really fun to just like interact with everyone. And it was really easy for me to transition from not knowing like anyone to like having like a nice close knit of friends over here at USC. So some tips I guess for like adjusting to like coming from high school to college is it's like during like the involvement fairs and when you see all the clubs, go to the meetings. They're really nice places to meet friends and they all mean well by that. I wish I went to some of my club meetings at like the beginning of my first semester because I was really lazy and I didn't go to them and I didn't get involved in as many of the things I wish I did. So that's probably what I would change if I were to start back all over again and try and do something different. All right, if you guys liked the video and you guys want to learn more about the top colleges, like and subscribe to Crimson Education and have a nice day. <laughs>